All right, we're back with part two. Basically, we just got done with our Quidditch lesson. Um, I don't know if we can actually do any lessons, like, right away. Oh, we can. I might save those, though, until we get a little bit further in the story and then just knock out our lessons, like, for potions, dueling, and flying. But right now, we gotta go meet, meet Ginny somewhere. Ron's just chilling here. Can't interact with him. All right. What do you think Dean sees in her, Ginny? I don't know. She's got nice skin. Nice skin? Mine's got nice skin. Hey, Harry! Uh, I need to, uh... Yeah, me too. Could you get me some sweets from Honeydukes? I've got to write two essays and make a shrinking solution for homework, so I can't go. I'll make the shrinking solution for you. Then you can come to Hogsmeade. Since when have you been into potions? It's no problem. Slughorn's let some students set up a potions club in the Herbology greenhouses. I can make it there. Okay, thanks. I'll meet you back here later. I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. Alright, looks like we got Herbology. Mischief managed. I actually wanted to know the name of this area because I wasn't sure what to label it in my timestamps. Training ground. Oh, there's a crest right there, but we need Incendio. We do have some crests we can get though. I think we can pick up six right now. We got one straight ahead. Okay, <laughs> I'm not sure how we didn't hit that. There we go. Got another one right here. This one. These are actually kind of tricky. You have to actually break them. And then you can pull them through. And then we have to repair them. Of us here. Need to get this further back. Wingardium Leviosa. So it's tricky. There we go. Yeah, remember to collect your mini crests, because that's how you actually get 25 more of them. Alright, now we gotta get to Herbology. Not entirely sure where that fine, is. Nick. I need to find the potions club. I think you'll find that particular little gathering in the Herbology greenhouses. Oh, here we go. Just get lost, Potter. We also have some crests in here. There's one inside of this bush. Oh, 
Got one over here. Not this, I'm not really sure why this is here. Nope. Wait, why did he just get hit from that or something? I got like hit out of it. <laughs> Flying. It's kind of hard to judge the angle. There we go. Is this Potions Club? Yes. Have you come to join? I've heard you're brilliant at potions this year. Thanks, but I just want to make a shrinking solution. I've got to get back to meet someone. Sorry, if you want to use our equipment, you'll have to join the Potions Club. All you need to do is choose the entry challenge on the notice board over there. Okay, thanks. All right. If you can beat the record score for brewing Volubilis Potion, you can join the Potions Club. Volubilis Potion is one of my favourites. Some people just use it to play tricks on others to change their voices, which seems a waste of a good potion to me. Syrup of Hellebore. Oh, I only got one great. Damn, I only got four stars. has brewed Volubilis Potion that well before, you can definitely join the Potions Club. Thanks. Can I make my shrinking solution now? I'm in a bit of a hurry. Stewed Lacewing Flies. We have to actually shake these now too? This is going to get even more in depth. Got solid ingredients too. Crap should take some of this. Shrimp. 
Rizzle Sick. I don't think that's gonna get me an outstanding. Hey, how did I get smoke? I didn't do anything yet. This makes perfect. I don't understand what happened. Oh, the bubbles only last for like a few seconds, that's why. Whoa. Careful. This is the hardest part for me because the bubbles only last for a couple of seconds. Like not even. <laughs> they last for like one second. Stop! Oh, come on. I was like one point away from five stars. I can't wait to see how you do in the other challenges. Come back and try them. Great. I'll definitely have a go, but I've got to meet Ginny Weasley at the Quidditch pitch now. That's okay. Just come back anytime. Oh, I can't do that right now. I was going to just redo them right away, but we're going to have to come back. Um, I think we got everything in Herbology. Actually, I think we are missing one crest somewhere back here. Yeah. Let's go back to Ginny. Someone. Looks like you're going to be late, doesn't it? Super fine. Oh, it's different. Harry, stop missing. Dodge and shot. I feel like because I'm carrying a potion in one hand, it just makes him really inaccurate. There we go. I'll get you back for that. Now you know what it feels like to be bullied. That was great, Harry. Crab and Goyle are always bullying people. Hey, you couldn't come and help us, could you? I'm the Hufflepuff Dueling Club captain, and some of the students in my house could really use some help with their defensive spells. Well, okay, but it'll have to be quick. Okay, everyone. Harry's agreed to show us Protego. Our Dueling Club junior champion has bravely volunteered to help. Okay, Harry, off you go. Oh. I'm holding down.
That's like a huge delay. Could you teach us how to charge spells too? Show us how it's done, Harry. That's different. Thanks, Harry. If you fancy another go, just sign up for a duel on the notice board over there. Yeah, we got even more duels. Hi, Ginny. I've made that shrinking solution for you. Thanks, Harry. That's brilliant. You wouldn't believe all the things I had to do on my way back to you. But I'm here now. Shall we go to Hogsmeade? Oh, sorry, Harry. I've arranged to go with Dean. He's not stopped moaning since I told him I couldn't go, and now I can. Yeah. Dean, uh, of course. You better go with him. I'll go with Hermione. See you later, Harry. Yeah. See you later. What was that potion you gave to Ginny? You've not been making more things from that potions book, have you? You don't even know who the Half-Blood Prince is. Let's go to Hogsmeade. Damn, Harry was just crushed right there. It's just... I'm starting to think this Prince character was a bit... dodgy. Isn't that Katie Bell? It's, it's nothing, nothing to do with you! <laughs> It's that necklace. It must be cursed. Malfoy knew about that necklace. It was on display at Borgin and Burke's. Katie was given the necklace in the ladies' toilet. How could Draco have put it in there? Good luck today, Ron. I know you'll be brilliant. I'm resigned after today's match. McLaggen can have my spot. Fine. Juice? You look dreadful, Ron. Is that why you put something in his cup? Don't know what you're talking about. Come on, Harry. We've got a game to win. You could be expelled for that. Right, looks like we gotta go to the Quidditch pitch again. I think we do have some something new happening here. Right here. You can't have it. I said I want it, and that means I will have it. Give it here, and I won't make you cry. Much. Hey. Buzz off, Potter. This is none of your business. Ron, move. Exterior. Oh. What the hell? She's doing my tactic. There we go. I don't know what her problem was. All right, that gets us this crest. About this match. See something else over here. Pick this one up. All right, there's that. Hey, Nick, some Nick your here. team awaits you at the Quidditch pitch. And Harry, try not to fall off your broom this year. Oh, yeah, sure, we have that one portrait shortcut. Well, well. If it isn't Possy Potter and Weasel King, you're going to lose today. 
Slytherin are supreme. Leave this to me. I'm feeling pretty confident. <laughs> and now for you, Potter. Let's see how well you play Quidditch after you've been stupefied. Stupefied! Oh, damn, that is pretty nuts. <laughs> Sorry about that, Harry. I did not expect a fully charged one to be like that. That's crazy. All right, we're actually going to go to the Owlery really quick because we have some crests we can pick up there. Alright, we're getting up by the Owlery right now. First Chris is right here. Come on, let's get this boulder over. I'm gonna have to bring it all the way back here first. Whoa. Not sure if we're hitting... I don't even know if it's hitting the wall right now. I think it's actually just ramping up off the step. There we go. There's one under the stair right there. The camera kind of hit it a bit. You got another one at the top. Alright, this should be all those. In this location, at least. All right, now I can head to the Quidditch pitch. They're all listening, watching, blooding. Those Quidditch players, so noisy, so rowdy. Oh, sorry. I'll ask my team to keep the noise down as they pass you. You're one of them, a captain too. You might as well use my shortcut, too. All the team captains do. My password is... Boiled Beetle. Thanks. All right, we got another portrait. Getting close to the Quidditch pitch. We actually have, like, a... A really tricky shield... Right here. And the thing that we need to hit it with... Is near the bottom of the stairs. Well, not the complete bottom, but further down, at least. <laughs> right here. Hey, trying to get it around Harry. <laughs> I basically have to be on the other side of it. That's a good camera angle. Problem is, when you hit this, and if you miss, <laughs> basically gotta keep bringing it all the way back up. Here, probably. I'm probably gonna miss. Oh, I got it. We got it. Then we gotta move all the way back down. There it is.
Let's go and beat Slytherin. What's got into him? He's just feeling... lucky. Right. Time for our pre-match warm-up. I've planned a few exercises that should help us get through. So, get your brooms and let's get flying! These are pretty straightforward. For now, I can see these getting ridiculous though. Found out that before she actually did want us to hit them. Gives you like a little bit more time to get through your ring. Damn, he actually pushed me out of the ring. That was so fast. I hate when they try to push you into those. I don't even know if you can really fit through them. How does a match work the same way? What? How did I not get that? <laughs> Thank you. 
that almost tripped me up. We should get this soon. There we go. You shouldn't have done it, Harry. Felix Felicis is illegal in organized competitions. I suppose I should have just confunded McLagan and the trials instead. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. Oh. And Ron only thought I'd given it to him. It turns out he can make his own luck. Well, he won't need me to take him to Slughorn's Christmas party. And you'd better decide who you're going with. How does it feel when you see Dean with Ginny? I know, Harry. I've seen how you look at her. Hermione, I'm sure Ron... Oh, don't worry about Ron. He can make his own luck. If a mine has got on knickers in a twist, what lav and I have, well, let's just say it's chemical. There's no stopping it. I suppose you're going to Slughorn's party? Yeah. I, I better go. I'm meeting Luna down by the boathouse. Luna? You can take any girl in the castle and you're taking Looney Lovegood. Yeah. One, one! Ooh! Have fun. Jeez, everything's moving quick. Happened abruptly. <laughs> All right. We gotta go to the boathouse. Pretty sure it's this way. Let's grab some of these mini crests really quick. Probably gonna have some crests we gotta get. Yeah. This is actually a pretty cool suit. <laughs> Alright, we're almost on our way down. We got a crest up ahead. Let's see two crests right here, too. Oh, but I don't know if I can interact with the fireworks yet, so we might not be able to get that one. Let's Hi, just Luna. talk to her. That's a nice dress. Do you think I should wear my radish earrings as well? Can't decide if they go with it. No, no, you look fine. I'm glad you came. Professor Slughorn asked me to set these fireworks off to announce his party, but I'm not sure what you're supposed to do with them. We just need to cast Incendio on their fuses. Oh nice, we're finally learning Incendio. Incendio! That's pretty! That's like the others! Grab this. There's that crest. Not sure we have anything in here. Alright, let's grab another one of these. These just blow up right away though, I don't know. 
Oh, damn, those just blow up, so we can't use that. Oh, here we go. There's a boulder right there. Alright, where are we heading? Yeah, well, I know that. I'll wait here. Let me know when you want to go to the party. Shall we light these fireworks now? Oh. Guess we have to go this way? Alright, I guess we're just heading up. Up here. There's the next one, Harry. There's another one. Let's light it. Okay. That's pretty. I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. Mischief managed. The auras have opened this part of the castle now. Come on, let's get a Slughorn's party. Right, looks like we're going to Slughorn's office. There's actually a crest over here, somewhere on our left. Yep. Yeah. Are you ready to go to the party? I seen another one with incendio. Are you ready to go to the party now? We also are gonna need this too. I wonder if I can hit it from here. Nope. We head downstairs. There's actually one that I didn't get the first time we came through here. Right above the entrance. It's really hard to see. Are you ready to go to the party now? It's right up there. I don't even know if I can throw it that high. Oh, come on, that was really close. No! No! There we go. Since we're going back down into the dungeons, we should be able to get that one that was behind the cobwebs now, too. I can remember exactly where it was. Are you ready to go so to the party this now? Way. I think it was right over here. Yeah. Are you ready to go to the party now? Luna, stop talking. Incendio! That all we've got? 
We got another one back here. Where is Slughorn's office? I don't remember them having to go through a dungeon cave. There's another crest. There's also another one right here. And where are we going? Harry, my boy, glad you came. There are so many people I want you to meet. Professor Slughorn, there's no one else here. Of course not. And a good job, too. We're not ready yet, not in the least bit ready. That's where I could do with a spot of help. I'm sure you and Miss, uh, uh... Lovegood. Here, we'll soon get the place in shape. I was going to rustle up a party punch for my guests, but time has not been willing. Could you mix something for me, perhaps? Yeah, we gotta stir. stirring. Um, I don't know what that is. This? No, it's not that. I hate trying to oh, shake bottles. Because they, they don't stay bubbled. There. No nodding off of the top. Please leave us a little air in the room, Harry. Is it no. not oh I see it now. Steady on there, Harry, my boy. I saw it. Usually it matches the color, and I didn't pay attention to the thing. What is he making us make? Excellent. 
shake it again. I think you should clear that smoke, my boy. Now we don't need to. Oh, I have to clear to finish it. Wonderful, a nectar from the gods, a taste of sunshine and happiness. I knew you were the man for the job, my boy. Our guests are here. Stop there, Potter. I only wish to convey a message. Professor Dumbledore asked me to give you his best. You see, he's traveling and won't return until term resumes. Traveling? Where? Take your hands off me, you filthy squib! No, no, Mr. Filch. What is all this fuss about? Okay, okay. I was gate crashing. Happy. I'll escort him out. I guess we're not even trying to remain inconspicuous, we're just straight up following him. What were you doing there? I don't have to tell you anything. I should do this. Did they even care that I'm following him? To help. see a crest on that night, but... You just want to steal my glory. Keep your voice down. <laughs> Maybe I did hex that Katie Bell girl. Maybe I didn't. What's it to you? I swore to protect you. I made the unbreakable vow. I don't need protection. I was chosen. This is my moment. Bloody hell. You don't think Snape was just pretending? No, he even said he'd taken an unbreakable oath. The unbreakable vow? Yeah. What happens if you break an unbreakable vow? You die. Everyone gone to bed? I don't sleep these days, so I wash my hair. Silly, right? Happy Christmas, Harry. Bellatrix! <laughs> Harry! Harry! Hello. Harry. Oh, we're just jumping into a duel. Oh, damn it. Oh, she didn't even discharge that. Again, that was too early. Damn, Your spells are getting way more powerful.
It's a trap! Get away from her! God, man, we're just fighting all the Death Eaters. Stop moving. Torn to pieces there. You're right. Yes, thank you. You're lucky you weren't killed, mate. Thanks for, you know, Ginny. If you'd not got there, I could have had a werewolf for a sister. Uh, yeah, yeah no problem. Dad said he checked Morgan and Burks. He said Malfoy was looking at a vanishing camera. A vanishing camera? What would he want with one of those? Dunno. Dad said it was still there in the shop. He's up to something. I just don't know what it is. Hi, Harry. Ron. Harry, I think Professor Slughorn is having another party for invited guests. Slug club? Maybe Slughorn can make you and Clag and King and Queen slug. See ya, Harry. Hermione, have you seen Malfoy doing anything suspicious? Oh, really, Harry? Are you still worried about Draco? Ron told me his dad found out Malfoy was looking at a vanishing cabinet in Borgin and Burke's. But there's no way he could sneak a vanishing cabinet into the castle. The Auras are searching everyone who comes in. They're even checking the outpost. Then you tell me how he disappears off the Marauder's map. I'll show you. I solemnly swear that I am up to no good. Mischief managed. He's there, in the seventh floor corridor. So, he's not disappeared then, has he? But sometimes he does vanish completely. I'm going to find out what he's up to. I'm going to the seventh floor. What's that I hear? Sounds like a scoop to me. Hot news goes cold fast. You better use my shortcut. Just say, happy headlines. Do you really think you'll find anything, Harry? Yes, I'll prove he's up to something. Right, a lot has, a lot has happened in a short amount of time. But I think this is a good place to end part two. Yeah, quickly getting through the story. It's really speeding through it uh, just dueling a bunch of people left and right I do like the fighting system in this game though it's a huge improvement over, over Order of the Phoenix yeah thanks for watching and I'll uh, see you in part 3